not exactly New Atlantis, eh? Because once we get started, I'm going to be riding your tail till this is over. There's uh, something you should know up front. I'm a Ko. As in Solomon Ko, first man on Aquila. That tail I mentioned before, the one I think is connected to an artifact, it's something of a family legend. After planet fall, Solomon spent years mapping Aquila. And he found a tiny little patch of nothing on his sensors. The kind of nothing an artifact produces. He called it the Empty Nest. Said it was a place even the wildlife of Aquila wouldn't go. Solomon's maps are locked up tight in the local Gal Bank. We'll be heading there. By order of Marshal Daniel Blake, I need to inform you, we've got some trouble at Gal Bank. Folks might be in danger, so you may want to steer clear. I guess that'd be the Marshal's call. Frankly, it ain't going well. Looks to be a stalemate. Maybe a little outside help would do some good. Well, I doubt those robbers are gonna let us leisurely peruse the Gal Bank vault. We better see if we can help move the situation along. You need to stand back now. I don't mean to be rude, but I don't know you. Now please, stand back. Mm. I wish I could say you were wrong, but I'm backed into a corner here. Some folks from the Shaw Gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a guard. They took everyone inside hostage, and now they're keeping a watch so we can't move against them. They're using the intercom to communicate. They won't talk to me. Say they don't trust the badge. <laughs> they want a neutral negotiator. In other words, they didn't have a plan for this, so they're stalling while they come up with one. Hmm. All right, I'm willing to allow that. But a few things first. Say what you have to, but whatever they ask for, there's no way in hell I'm giving it to them. Also, there are lives at stake, so don't get cavalier. Find out what they want, and then report back to me. Hey, you in the bank. I'm sending in a negotiator, so don't shoot. Hands where I can see him, and don't try nothing. Negotiator, huh? If you think you're just gonna walk up here and get us to surrender, you're dead wrong. We'll cooperate when we get what we want. So tell me, stranger, how do I know you're gonna deal straight with us? <laughs> I don't know you, so why should your word mean anything to me? Yeah? Well, maybe that's just what you want us to think, so we'll give up. Whoa! Take it easy there. Well, I guess you have a point. Hey! 
Am I supposed to be impressed? Nothing you say is gonna change my mind, so let's just move on. Got a real attitude problem, don't you? Well, you better listen up. We want to guarantee a safe passage to the spaceport and a ship. We'll drop the hostages off somewhere safe in the system. After that, we'll radio back where they are and the Marshal and his crew can come and get them. But if anybody follows us when we break orbit, we start shooting people. Got it? Oh, hell, the Freestar Rangers have got ships. They can give us one of them. <sighs> this whole damn job's gone wrong. It was supposed to be just a quick hit. Clean and simple, you know? So let's just... Let's all try to keep our heads, yeah? Because my guys, they're going crazy in here. I don't know how much longer we can last. What do you mean? I know, I know. I'm not disagreeing with that. You have to believe me, we never meant to take hostages. Sometimes bad things happen to innocent people. That's life. Nah, it's too late to back out now. We're seeing this through. You go tell the Marshal to get that ship ready so we can all walk away from this thing without anybody getting hurt. Those guys are scared. I can tell. I heard every word. He's talking too loud. Sign of fatigue. All that fear and exhaustion are taking a toll. They're not thinking straight. That puts us in a very precarious position. Yeah. You're right. You gave those boys a chance, but now they have to lie in the bed they made. Problem is, they're keeping me and the guards in sight at all times. If we try to move against them, they'll see us coming. You'd be willing to do that? You've got guts, that's for damn sure. I can't deny that you're right, though. They might not see that coming. Now, I see two ways we can play this. You could ask to see the hostages. Once you're inside, you can make your move. If you're quick, I think you can take them out before they have a chance to respond. But you'll have to shoot to kill. There's also a back door. Most of their attention's focused out front here, so they may not be watching it as closely. This key should unlock it. Mr. Wright's gonna be looking for an apprentice soon. A robot takes a peach of a job. Can you get certified in time?
Spider! Heads hit damage! All you. Of us all. I heard the fight. The hostages, are they safe? That's... that's good to hear. Those people aren't just citizens of the Free Star Collective, they're like family. We all are. As for the Shaw Gang, we'll grieve for them too. Here, you've more than earned this. You got us out of a tough spot, and you did it with courage that's not common. As a matter of fact, you might just be Freestar Ranger material. If you're interested, head on over to The Rock and ask for Emma Wilcox. She handles the new recruits. All right. Now that lives are on the line, let's get back in Galbag, see if we can get those maps. I can't wait to get back to the ship. The gravity here... I've had... Well, I suppose I'll have to write a report about all of this. All right, let's get back to that bank vault. Take it easy.
shakeup. Of course that old mule saw this coming. That we do. I was hoping to avoid the estate when we landed. Cora's gonna be so mad. We really gotta do this. You're not wrong. I know, it's just... It's personal. <sighs> Alright, fine. He's my dad, okay? We're not exactly on friendly terms. He probably figured I'd come for the maps at some point. Got ahead of me. Family business just wasn't something I wanted to get into, you know? Yeah, well, sorry I'm such a pain about it. No forgiveness between me and my old man. It's, uh, cold tradition. All right, shall we? Family was on the That's the rock. Ranger Central. Not a bad part, too. The mirror wolf at the low house could really use someone helpful like you. decides to darken our doorstep again. You know why I'm here. Oh? What's that? You come to your senses? Realize where you ought to be for once? I ain't asking again. You ain't asked once. Let's hear it. I want you to say the words about what's more important to you than family. Okay, this was a mistake. The only mistake I'm seeing here is you. Bringing your constellation lackey here instead of my granddaughter. Come to help Sam loot his ancestry? You're not getting those maps. Full stop. Nothing's more important than family. Nothing. If Sam had stuck around, he'd know that. You wouldn't be here. All right, that's enough. Come on, let's you and I talk. In private. <laughs> Welcome home, Sam. Make your visit short, okay? It's what you do. It's good to be out and about. Well, I just get stuffy sometimes. Give me a sec. <sighs> All right, let's talk options. You're flying in the face of my 30 plus years experience with the man, but all right. I hope you like arguing. Sam's constellation lackey here to bother me again? Well, that's not your decision, is it? It's called property by birthright. It stays here. You really believe that, don't you? You think I'm not trying to help him? <laughs> Can't believe I'm saying this. But if it'll get you out of my hair, then fine. You can have the maps. They're in the other room, here. Key. All right, let's see if we can find the empty nest. All right, let me think. The way I heard it, the readings he was getting were normal at first, then they bottomed out. And no creature, alien or otherwise, would dare step inside. There. Found it. Oh, boy. 
that's a problem. First, it's in the middle of the frontier, which we already expected. No problems there, but the usual tussling with alien wildlife. But the Empty Nest is a cave right in the middle of Shawgang territory. Same outlaws who held up Galbank. Well, just remember, it's about the artifact, not them. Hurting bad guys puts a smile on your face, that's a bonus. Let's get to that cave. But it's nothing that would keep me from getting back out there.
Better we get it than someone else. You heard that right. Keep it together. It's all that.
cave like this would be a perfect nest for the ash to... Something's keeping them away. Certainly. There's so many planets, moons, celestial phenomena. Most captains just sail through the Great Black, not even really looking, appreciating. A lot of the time, touching down on a virgin planet can be, well, uneventful. But every now and then, you see something no human has ever laid eyes on. That is what I live for. Later. times. Looting the dead ain't glamorous, but it sure is profitable.
You've done this before, right? Care to do the honors? for a moment. I think that's far enough. Hate to put a hole in the head of Aquila's own prodigal son. At least not before we've had a word. You must be Shaw. What I am is disappointed. Samco in the flesh and he's peddling around the frontier with the has-beens of Constellation. 
Now you got past my crew, who I pay quite handsomely, I might add. Grabbed something from that weird cave. Probably whatever's been keeping the Ashto away. So, I'm down one hideout. Now, let's talk about what all that's worth to me. Your lives, your credits. One or the other, really. Oh, really? Let's hear it. Huh. The Shaw Gang's name in print outside a wanted poster does sound nice. Always good to know someone who can keep their mouth shut. Nobody wants that. Maybe we can work something out. <laughs> Fine. Get the hell out of here before I change my mind. I see you again. You're dead. What? It's the Ashta. You. This is your fault. You better lend us a hand. of our little family really pulled through for us. Just, what are we building here? I haven't picked up any kind of frequency or signal coming from it. That doesn't mean much. This thing could be emitting something we can't even detect. As far as we know, we could be building a gigantic bomb that will blow up as soon as we finish it. Or maybe it's some kind of interstellar children's toy. Why would either of those things give the Discoverer visions and music? It's a message. I'm sure of it. We just have to hope that finding more of the pieces will give us some clue. I hear that. Moving forward sometimes means fumbling around in the dark. I think Cora and I can use some downtime, but you let me know if you ever want to team up again. 
Oh, and since it tends to come up, me and my Rugrat co-pilot work as a team. That's non-negotiable. If I'm coming with, that means Cora is on your ship. Hmm. <laughs> Why not? What do you think, Cora? It's really nice to have more company. New stories, new data. What? Data? <laughs> All right. We're in. Let's see what the galaxy throws at us next. <laughs> <laughs>